Alright ladies and gentlemen, back to Tekken 7 character customization and now we're going to, in this video, try our best because I looked at all the customization options for this we're going to try to turn Leo into Shulk from Xenoblade Chronicles it's going to be a tall order and we won't be able to get it 100% accurate but at the very least we'll be able to get the colors right so I'm going to say Let's just go with what they have, and let's try to make it work the best as we can. Oh, cool. so I'm looking at a picture right now of Shulk uh, from Xenoblade Chronicles, and I wish I had a side-by-side -side, uh, video editor or something like that, so we could take a look at this, and I could do like a side-by-side -side comparison. I don't know if I'd be able to do it after the video was finished. Yeah. But um, yeah, we're gonna do this to the best that we can because I don't really see how we're gonna make this really work correctly. Um, now, Shulk's hair is kind of baggy. Oh, and it's the same Shulk that was in uh, Smash Brothers for the Wii U. So, just in case anybody was wondering. But yeah, his, his hair is kind of shaggy. And this is back when I was talking about in the last video how the colors don't really match uh, what's on the palette. Like the colors on the item that's you're changing. The colors on the item that you're trying to change don't really match what's on the palette. So like this right here is supposed to be like a dark, but it's like, it's bright. You know, it's not, it's not really matching. Yeah, this brown right here is more so Folks, color. Um, Folk had no glasses. Well, Shulk had a beard. Not. Uh, this is where it's gonna get tough because I don't, I really don't know what to do. I think the closest thing that Leo has to what Shulk has on is this one. Now this one has like a different undershirt. So, I might be able to pull something off of this if I turn everything black on the inside. Let me change this right here, see if we, what it looks like. So. I don't know what good this is going to do. I'm not really... Wait a minute, I don't even think Shulk had a necklace. Did Shulk have a necklace? So we can just get a silver or something. I don't know. And top of the jacket had to be red. I don't think it had any designs on it. I say this part was gonna be well it does, but that, the way it looks is like the lining of the vest that he has on. Has some silver, so because of that, I think I'm gonna change, leave this like silvery, like a silverish gray. And we're gonna turn this jacket red, just like a light red. Though. More so like that. More so like a rusty red color, like a rusty red. That's the closest thing that they got to it. So, come on. Leave it at that. Alright. I'm kind of surprised they didn't let you change the orange. That little orange tinge right there on the second. Um. There really wasn't anything else I, could, I had that could assemble that vest. Do they even have a vest on here for Leo? They do not. So. The options really were limited. If I change it to this, it wouldn't really do too well. Like I said, the under, that long screen underneath is supposed to be black, so. Hey man, like I said, th this is really a tall order. This is a tall order. And so had on shorts. Oh no, not that short. Um, Basically, this. This kind of. I don't, I don't think you have anything else. Yeah, I did say this is going to be 
tall order, so don't get mad at me. Like, I'm literally working with everything that they have available, and it's not much. Um, um, that's it. Alright, so his hands. Oh. Okay, so the shorts themselves. Now we've only got one color to choose from. And the boots are more so like a red. The belt. I don't really know what color the belt was, but just for the sake of the jacket, we're gonna just make that red too. What I'm really worried about getting accurate is these pants. Now we're getting on the shoes. Alright, so the shoes have two tones, so that's actually helpful. On the inside of his shoes are for black, and the outside of his shoes is red. Had some ankle braces and all that on, but this is the knee pads, but I have no way to put that on. Options here was seriously limited. Maybe there is a different jacket I can get. Let me buy this one because this one seems like it. The reason it seems like it has because of that undershirt, I'll get away with something else. Let me try it. Oh, that's a solid color, I can't do the thing. Alright, um... I'm trying right now, man, I'm trying. The color options on this. Okay, so we got a few, let's try to make... Alright, let's wait for it. Turn that red. Didn't really have any. Didn't have any gloves, so we just match that to the color of the division. Just to let's just make them like that. Make them like that. Um, under jacket, we're gonna make that. Uh, let's say. He does have a tinge of blue hanging at the outline of his uh his undershirt. Well, the undershirt, but it's mainly black, so we're gonna do it like that. But we can turn this black too. Okay, nice, nice. That's the outline. Damn. So okay, let's do it like this then. The undershirt. It's a blue knot, but do that. Mm. Not quite. Not quite. version but you know the best that we can do what we had available for us I don't want to say I could probably pull something off with this but it's not it's not gonna work unless they 
update the game with some other stuff. I don't see that happening with anything else. Maybe this would have worked, but not really. Yeah, this is as good as it's gonna get for until they update the game with more stuff. I don't see myself um, getting a better jacket than that. I just don't like the fact that those chains are hanging down and I can't turn that orange part red to match the rest of the jacket. That's the only thing. Other than that, that's as good as that gonna get. We just need to find the right sword. I probably don't have it unlocked, but we can still see what it looks like. There you go, right there. That looks more so like something like from God Eater, but instead of right here, but when I unlock that, I mean that's basically it right there. So yeah, most definitely that's going to be the sword. Whenever I unlock that, that's definitely going to be. The item that, you, that I would give him. That's the closest thing that he has to his actual sword in the Xenoblade Chronicles. So, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I said in the beginning of the video it was going to be a tall order. I didn't think I was going to be able to pull it off. Um, it was just an idea. So, I did the best what I could with what I had available to me. Hope you guys still enjoyed it though.